Hi, I'm David from Perfect Photo. Today I'll be talking about how to review a wedding portfolio. Photography is both an art and a craft. The art part is purely subjective. That's when you get an emotional response from a photo. A great picture can make you smile, laugh, or feel love. Since everyone has a different emotional response, I'm going to talk more on the craft, or the technical part of what I think makes a photo great. For weddings, I feel the three most important technical skills are clean exposure, accurate color, and being consistent throughout the wedding day. Clean exposure is really important for wedding photos. I mean, let's face it, you spent thousands on your wedding dress. I personally want to see lots of detail in the beading, in the lace, and the stitching. It's a shame to see wedding photos with the bride wearing a paper white dress holding paper white flowers. Having accurate color is also important. Some of our couples give us fabric swatches so we can match their colors perfectly. The invitations match the linens, the linens match the flowers, the flowers match the bridesmaids' dresses. With all the planning involved, it's important to have clean color throughout the wedding. And that brings me to the last point, consistency. Here's the big secret about wedding photography. We photographers only show our best work on our websites. So really, when you look at our websites, you're looking at the best photos we've ever taken. What you should ask every photographer you're looking at is, can I see a complete wedding, unedited, with no Photoshop work? What you're looking for is accurate exposures, sharp details, good color, and of course, strong emotion from start to end. I hope this has been helpful. In part three of our series, I'll share the top five questions to ask your wedding photographer. They're not what you might think, so be sure to check it out.